So let us now, you know, look at our, you know, case study today. And the context is critical here because it's CRPF Jawans who are actually going on a long operation into deep forests and they are supposed to filter available water from nalas or from water bodies or from the rain and drink that water. So what is this whole story? We'll go one by one and see how the context addressed every aspect of the design and innovation journey. We at IIT Bombay have this Center for Excellence in internal security. This was set up by government of India and around uh, 10 professors were actually you know roped in into the center to work for technologies for the armed forces. We have so much of technology strength over here and so this center is supposed to bridge this gap. My colleagues from aeronautical professor Hemindra Arya went for this trip and he came back and said Professor Chakrati it was very intriguing to watch the type of hardships our Jawans face when they are in the field and you know we have to do something for them you know so let me just quickly uh, take you to the video of uh, professor arya i am core faculty in the center which deals with the internal security in this regard some crpf officers visited and they gave their requirements for various issues which are related to internal security they explained me about a need for a water bottle which can help them in having a clean water when they are in operation. And typically they have to carry around seven, eight liters of water. So keeping this in view, I asked them, what are their requirements? So you just look at the cause coming in Professor uh, Arya's tone. They are, you know, starving. They're starving for water when they're in long operations. Sometimes the operations last more than the duration which they planned for. So they have to look for local water sources. They have to, you know, go drink those water. So this is like, we get a lot of these interesting insights when you talk to the users. And uh, the commandant officer, he said that I need to take these professors to the remotest areas where there is the most hostile environmental factors. Because in design innovation, remember, when you do your, you know, context and cause and your data collection, you have to look at the worst condition for your study. If you look at the good conditions, you're not going to get good ideas and good designs. So they took us to the very, very tough situations, remote operations, as we say.